Rusty Brown here at the 2017 Fred Hall Show, uh, Phoenix Bait Pro Staff, uh, professional guide and professional bass fisherman, Southern California. Uh, I'm going to be talking about uh, some Phoenix jigs here, uh, some of the uh, uh, great sizes. We've got uh, different colors uh, on how to rig them, uh, trim them, and uh, the trailers that I put on them. Um, the first jig that I'd like to start with here is the uh, black and blue Pro-Line football in the 3 8 uh, This is a versatile jig for year-round fishing, uh, wintertime, springtime. Uh, it's, a, it's a big bite color for uh, the big bass. It's uh, great for dirty water. Um, the weed guards, I like to have weed guards on there. That way I can trim them up. Um, I can show everybody uh, how to do that right now. First thing I'd like to do is you grab a pair of scissors, good scissors, and I like to take the weed guard and clip just a little bit of it off on an angle, 45 degree angle. Also, I take the scissors and go down and take a big part of the weed guard or the insert of it off. And then that kind of flares. You wanna just kind of make sure that weed guard is soft so when the fish bite the jig, they can have a good bite on that hook. So you wanna make sure your, your weed guard's flared out a little bit. I'll trim a little bit more off. And that's perfect with that. The second step you want to do is you want to take your jig and kind of look at the skirt and see where the placement is. You take your scissors, and I like to always cut up on an angle with the jig. That way it's nice and even, but it flares out better that way. So I'll take my scissors and just cut up on an angle, almost in a V. And right there you have a perfectly cut. The jig was longer. I've kind of downsized it a little bit but it's still bulky and it's still going to flare out okay for the next jig here uh, we've got the twilight moss this is the phoenix football uh, head jig uh, a little different hook design uh, it's got the little recessed uh, eye right there um, it's a perfect bait for springtime uh, summertime fishing the green pumpkin a little bit of pumpkin on it uh, i'm going to show how to put a trailer on the back a craw trailer on the back of this jig uh, this is just this is a great color for small mouth and, uh, and large mouth any lake. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my craw trailer and I'm just going to flip the jig over again. This has already been trimmed and cut. This is ready to cast. So I've got the skirt already ready to trim down, ready to go. I take my craw trailer and I'll run down the hook right in the center of the top of the craw and I'll pull that bait right through and slide it up the collar. One thing I like about the Phoenix and the Proline jigs is uh, they've got great collars, so they hold the baits really well on there, especially when you're fishing deep water or you're pitching and flipping. And uh, there's the finished product right there on the half ounce Twilight Moss Phoenix jig. Okay, what we got here, we got here is we got the Rusty's Big Fish jig. Uh, it's the Proline. It's a black and purple skirt, three eighths to five eighths football head. Um, you've got the nice little line insert right there to put the uh, tie your knot on. Um, really good weed guards. It's just a great, great jig. The reason why I call it the Rusty's Big Fish jig because it catches a lot of big fish. Uh, it catches them from San Diego to Northern California to uh, Central California, Southern California. It works everywhere. It works, you know, nationwide. But uh, it's got a little bit of purple in it. It's got a combination of black silicone, black rubber. It's just a bulky, bulky jig. Uh, this jig's already been trimmed, ready to go. I'm going to take my craw trailer. Flip the jig upside down. I'm going to take my craw trailer and I'm going to go ahead and rig that right down the dead center and pull that bait right through. And again, they got a great collar to pull that bait up on so that bait stays nice and snug. And there's the finished product right there. You got Rusty's Big Fish Jig Pro Line. And it's a great, great compact bait. The, the skirt really flares out a lot in the water on this bait. I think that's what appeals to big fish. It really likes that. Um, you can go on, uh, on my website, rustybasshook.com, uh, and check on the colors and all the different sizes on these Pro Line and Phoenix bait jigs. And uh, give me a call and uh, book a trip, and I'll get you out there and show you how to throw these jigs. Rusty Brown here at the uh, 2017 Fred Hall Show, Long Beach. Um, I've got a Proline jig here. This is my Rusty's Big Fish jig. It's uh, purple and black. Uh, it's a perfect, perfect color for Southern California, any of the dirty water lakes, clear water lakes. It's just a great color. It's uh, my Big Fish jig. Catches a lot of big fish. I'm going to go ahead and pitch it into the tank, see if we can get a bite on it. Flip that bait out there. 
let that bait go to the bottom. Half ounce gets down pretty far. You can just kind of hop the jig along. I like to crawl it really slow. Southern California, we kind of do the Southern California crawl. I let it sit a little bit, then I'll hop it. When the fish are real active, they like it when it's just kind of hopping along. But the main thing you want to do is you don't want to drag that thing too far. Fish come up and nail it. Fish Phoenix and get hooked.